हेलो व्यूअर्स वेलकम टू दी लर्नर्स नर्सिंग क्लासेस आज हम कवर करेंगे ऑप्स्टेटिक्स एंड गायनोकोलॉजी के मल्टीपल चॉइस क्वेश्चन सो द साइक्लिक ब्लीडिंग एट अ नॉर्मल इंटरवल बट इधर एक्सेसिव इन अमाउंट और ड्यूरेशन इज टर्म्ड एज हेयर द आंसर इज मेनोरेजिया वॉट इज द फुल फॉर्म ऑफ डी यू बी इट इज डिसफंक्शनल यूटराइन ब्लीडिंग in following which hormonal therapy is used for the management of uh, disproportionate uterine bleeding so the therapy is contraceptive pills norethesterone uh, 17 alpha ethyl testosterone so answer is all of these physical changes occur during puberty includes breast development growth of the uh, pubic and axillary hair menstruation so here the answer is all above the first menstruation in a female is called as menarche in female at which age menarche occurs 13 years which hormone plays an important role in marked proliferation of fat around the breast estrogen starting of menstrual cycle before the age of 10 years is called as precocious permanent cessation of menstruation is termed as menopause endocrinological changes occur during menopause includes except matlab kaun sa nahi hai so here the answer is fall in the follicle stimulating hormone After menopause increased facial hair growth and changes in the voice occur due to increase in the androgen levels After puberty obese patients have less chances of occurrence of osteoporosis because of the conversion of more androgens into estrogens In female changes occur after menopause includes see all of these uterus becomes smaller the vagina becomes narrower and ovaries shrink in size in following which statement is false after menopause the ratio remains 3 is to 1 is the answer rest all statements are true after menopause a woman becomes more prone to the development of osteoporosis because fall in the estrogen levels in a post menopausal female which is the principal hormone used in the hormonal replacement therapy estrogens causative organism of syphilis is treponema pallidum treatment of premenstrual syndromes includes all of these so minor tranquilizers use of antidepressants and pyridoxin so treatment includes all of these post menopausal yellowish or blood stained vaginal discharge soreness in the vulva and pruritus uh, vulvae are the manifestations of senile vaginitis What is the common cause of senile vaginitis? Estrogen deficiency. In female, possibility of for occurring acute endometritis is more after abortion and childbirth. Pelvic inflammatory disease is more common in females except in the pregnant woman in following which statement is false see here the statement is pid pelvic inflammatory disease is more common in women who are taking oral contraceptive so this statement is not true in following which is the most reliable aid to diagnose pelvic inflammatory disease laparoscopy you can visualize uh, through laparoscopic procedure in the pelvic cavity 
about the pelvic inflammatory disease in following which is not a sexually transmitted disease see fibroid uterus is not a sexually transmitted disease sexually transmitted disease lymphogranuloma venerum is caused by chlamydia trachomatis who discovered immunodeficiency virus berry sonosi in following which statement is false transmission of hiv from female to male is high this statement is false rest all are true after hiv infection there is immunodeficiency mainly due to why there is a deficiency in immunity that is due to decrease number of cd4 t lymphocytes the answer is option a following tests are done to identify hiv infection except see elisa and western blot and polymerase chain reaction all of these are hiv tests so vidal is not an hiv test it's a typhoid test in following which is not a characteristic features of gonococcal self selfingitis so infection occurs following abortion or childbirth is not a characteristic feature of the uh, gonococcal selfingitis collection of mucus into the fallopian tube is called as hydrocephalus inflammation of ovaries is termed as ophritis most commonly used and effective treatment of vaginal trichomoniasis is metronidazole also called as flagell the condition in which whole organ turns backward in relation to the long axis of the birth canal is termed as so here the answer is retroversion of the uterus normal position of the uterus is in the pel pelvic cavity how it is it is antiverted and antiflexed the structure which provides support to the uterus includes the round ligament the broad ligament and cervical vaginal junction so here the answer is all above etiological factors responsible for genital prolapse includes following except matlab kaun sa nahi hai to isme decreased weight of the uterus is not the factor in following which is the most important acquiring predisposing factor in genital prolapse vaginal delivery with consequent injury to the supporting structure degree of uterine prolapse in which the external os protrudes outside the vaginal introitus but the uterine body still remains inside the uterus is the second degree prolapse clinical manifestations includes genital prolapse here the answer is difficulty in passing urine and uh, backache is there and difficulty in passing stool so all above when female moves about she feels that something is coming down per vagina the female is suffering from genital prolapse in how many cases of total infertility males are responsible so as per the study 30 to 40 percent of the total cases males are responsible for the infertility in carter jenner syndrome excessive production of sperm is there or there is a loss of ciliary function and motility in the sperm or ability of sperm to penetrate ovum increases or ability of vaginal canal to receive sperm increases so in carter jenner syndrome there is loss of ciliary function and the motility in the sperm congenital factor related to male that is responsible for infertility includes 
all above and descended testes on hypospadias and cartagena syndrome a male with hypospadias disease is unable to deposit sperms high in the vagina the condition that raises the scrotal temperature includes all of see varicocele filariasis and big hydrocele these all will increase the temperature of the scrotum at which stage of fertilized ova is transferred into the uterine cavity during in vitro fertilization so it is the 4 to 8 cell stage health hazards of assisted reproductive technology includes multiple pregnancies and ectopic pregnancy and psychological stress answer is all in following which is the commonest benign solid tumor in females so here answer is very simple the fibroid uterus is the uh, commonest benign solid tumor in females fibroid uterus is more common in so here the answer is nullipara women nullipara mean do uh, jinhone kabhi child birth nahi kiya hai they never uh, bear bear pregnancies in following which is the classic symptoms of uterine fibroid the answer is menorrhagia in following which is the life threatening complication of the fibroid life threatening uh, complication of fibroid can be all of this persistent menorrhagia leading to anemia severe infection leading to peritonitis and sarcoma following the changes are uh, following changes are seen in fibroid uterus except concern nahi hai so endometrial hypoplasia is not there rest everything is there in fibroid uterus which condition may cause infertility here the answer is elongation of uterine cavity dilatation of the endometrial venous plexus fibroid uterus prevents rhythmic or uterine contractions during intercourse so answer here is all above what is the meaning of endometriosis the presence of functioning endometrium in the site other than the uterine mucosa is the uh, endometriosis the common site of endometriosis is ovaries pouch of douglas and abdominal scar following hysterectomy in following which is not a symptom of endometriosis hypomenorrhea is not a symptom drug used for treating endometriosis includes all we use combined estrogen and progesterone oral pills denazol and we use uh, in stage 2 cervical cancer of here the answer is the carcinoma extend beyond the cervix but has not extended to the pelvic wall staging of cervical cancer is primarily based on the clinical examination in following which is not a good prognostic factor in cervical cancer poorly differentiated squamous cell carcinoma following is the high risk women for cervical cancer sexual intercourse in early age early age for the first pregnancy and having too many frequent births so answer is all primary prevention of cervical cancer includes except radiotherapy in primary prevention radiotherapy is not there normally first sensation of urination is felt at 150 to 200 ml of bladder volume 
एंड एब नॉर्मल कम्युनिकेशन बिटवीन यूरिनरी एंड जेनाइटल ट्रैक इज नोन एज जेनाइटो यूरिनरी फिस्टूला इन विच ऑफ द फॉलोइंग टाइप ऑफ फिस्टूला इज द मोस्ट कॉमनली फाउंड फिस्टूला सो आंसर इज वेसिको वजाइनल फेस्टूला इन विच गायनोकोलॉजिकल डिसऑर्डर देर इज अ कंटिन्यूस एस्केप ऑफ यूरिन पर वेजाइनम वेसिको वेजाइनल फिस्टूला मोस्ट कॉमन कॉजेस ऑफ वेसाइको वेजाइनल फिस्टूला इज ऑब्स्टेटिकल मीन्स रिलेटेड टू डिलीवरीज एंड चाइल्ड बर्थ when the methylene blue solution is introduced into the bladder by a catheter the dye seen coming through the vaginal opening this occurs due to the presence of vesico vaginal fistula ideal time for local repairing of vesico vaginal fistula is 3 to 6 months following delivery the most common cause of utero vaginal fistula is trauma during pelvic surgeries involuntary escape of fetus and or feces into the vagina may occur due to recto vaginal fistula when there is a fistula between the rectum and the vagina in following which is the commonest cause of recto vaginal fistula incomplete healing or unrepaired recent complete perineal tear in following which is surgical procedure is commonly used for the treatment of vesico vaginal fistula here the answer is local repair by flap splitting methods presence of both male and female external and or internal genital organ is in the same individual causing confusion in the diagnosis of true sex is termed as hypersex hypersexuality what do you mean by male intersex so answer is it is association of male gonads with female external genitalia during lactation which factor is responsible for amenorrhea the answer is high levels of prolactin the condition in which there is a periodic shedding of the endometrium and bleeding but the menstrual blood fails to come out from the genital tract is termed as cryptomenorrhea which is the commonest cause of cryptomenorrhea imperforate hymen the normal upper limit for the menarche is 15 years cause of primary amenorrhea includes except kaun sa nahi hai so hyper secretion of the follicle stimulating hormone absence of menstrual cycle for 6 months or more following a normal menstruation is termed as secondary amenorrhea in following which is not a cause of secondary amenorrhea imperforate hymen polycystic ovarian disease may cause secondary amenorrhea due to the excessive productions of the androgens what is the action of barrier contraceptive method see the action of barrier contraceptive met- method is they prevent sperm deposition in the vagina intrauterine devices inhibit pregnancy by interfering implantation of fertilized ova in the uterus oral contraceptive pills inhibit the pregnancy by suppressing the ovulation in following which is uh, which contraceptive method is most commonly used by males 
here the answer is condoms in following which is not a contraceptive method for females see answer is nsv non scalpel vasectomy which is the commonest abnormality in azoospermic male chromosomal answer is klein felter syndrome testicular failure due to gonadotropin deficiency is termed as kalman syndrome fault in male that may cause infertility includes see mumps or kites raised fetal temperature and undescended testes answer is all in following which factor is not responsible for infertility antiverted uterus is not a factor which is responsible for infertility ph of normal semen is 7.2 to 7.8 normal sperm concentration in semen is 20 million per ml or more failure of formation of semen is known as aspermia the condition in which there is no spermatozoa in semen is termed as azoospermia absence of fructose content in the seminal fluid is uh, fluid suggest the congenital absence of seminal vesicles followings are the indications of intrauterine examination except so here kaun sa nahi hai so recurrent abortion is not an indication of intrauterine examination thank you